Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. I've got a seltzer. This arrived um, just the other day. Um, I was contacted with a message about um, being one of the first to review this for them. This is from Willie's Super Brew, hard seltzer plus real fruit. Um, this is a, uh, um, a limited release. Um, Let's see, Seltzer Unleashed, a juicy, hazy, hopped seltzer. So this is not just, you know, like a regular seltzer. This is, um, um, it's a, you know, a fancy crafted type seltzer. Um, got mango, it's got, it's got, um, where does it say? Re plus real fruit, right? Okay, so got mango, pineapple, guava and lime with a cit uh, citra citra and mosaic hops um so that's pretty different uh it's got 23 percent juice um it says all it says on here it all started on a goat farm and now the goats have escaped we're testing the limits of seltzer one limited release at a time can a seltzer have as much flavor as a double IPA. What is a hazy seltzer? Pour it out and see. This is Seltzer Unleashed. So the ingredients says water, alcohol from sugar, pineapple juice concentrate, mango puree, guava juice concentrate, citra hops, mosaic hops, and lime juice concentrate brewed by Willie's out of Pawtucket Rhode Island in East Boston Massachusetts contains sulfites okay 6% ABV nice colorful can there see that goat there he's he's uh, planning his his escape getting his plan together <clears throat> okay this was also sent to me it says uh, tasting notes the hops and pineapple shine through in the nose with the intense juiciness of mango and guava hitting at first sip a nice tangy citrus note comes through from the lime followed by a delicate bitterness of the hop blend at 20 uh, at the hop blend period at 23 percent juice it's truly unlike any other seltzer so there you go welcome to seltzer unleashed we hope you enjoy this special gift the first limited release in the seltzer unleashed series it's inspired by the juiciest of ipas but bursting with the real fruit willies is known for Cheese, cheers. Almost said cheese. If you want to scan that, okay. All right. So they sent me this glass, which I thought is pretty cool. In there with this can, I got it nice and cold right now. I got a little glass. I'm going to pour in here for Jeremy to try some because he wasn't able to do the review with me so uh, I'm gonna pour a little bit in here for him to give it a shot okay it says IRC beer IRC don't know what that stands for Okay, I haven't been a real big fan of seltzers. Um, my problem with the seltzers I first started trying was that this didn't have enough flavor to me. Um, other reviewers, you know, found it to have what they call a, just, a, just a splash of flavors that they're saying on the, on the cans, on the labels. Um, well, the, the splash, it, it was more of a, just a drip. Uh, for me, I just wasn't getting enough flavor. I was, 
you know, it was I was getting just mostly seltzer water, and I just got a hint, just a little hint of the taste. I want a little bit more, but I have had um, uh, recently. Let's see, I can't remember what that was. A really good seltzer, and uh, I've had a couple others. Shoot, what were they? Can't remember off the top of my head. But I'm fine. I'm, if I get a seltzer, it's got a little bit more flavor to it. I will. I will enjoy that a lot more. From the way this sounds, it sounds to me like there's more flavor in here, and I should get it with all these different fruit fruits in there, and then also the hops. There shouldn't be any way around that I I won't get you know some flavor. So that's what I'm going to be looking for. Let's uh, let's get this thing open. I feel inspired to roll this. I don't know why. I guess because I saw puree in there on the ingredients. So just in case, with all that ingredients that's in there, all that different real fruit and stuff, I feel I should just kind of roll it. This is just me. No one else has to do it that way. But I just think if I don't and I see that there's there's some sediment of stuff in there, I'd be disappointed because I want it to be, I want mine not to be settled on the bottom. I want, I want to experience the full, you know, the full amount of what's in there. So, so there you go. Ooh. Okay. Let's see what we got. Ooh. It's hazy. I feel I feel good about that. I I kind of rolled it a little bit. Wow. Ooh. Wow, that tasted that little sip I got off the edge of the can. It looks like a um, a double IPA, one of those juice bombs. Um, I I don't I can't, I may have had one that was um, kind of a juice bomb type. IPA with just a lot of, you know, good color and good, you know, thick, thick consistency uh, of, of the, of the beverage. And, uh, this just looks like that. It has the appearance of like a, a mango or orange juice or something. Um, but it looks really good. Mm, I'm getting like an orange juice, a little bit of a sweet mango mix in there. It smells like a like an IPA, um, just a little more toned down than the regular aroma from a from an IPA. Yeah, it smells good. So, yeah, let's let's give it a try. like a medium carbonation burn, um, a, a, tangy, a tanginess with a little bit of mango and, and a little bit of an orangish type taste, a little dryness on the back end. Um, despite the color of it, it has a more of a thin body. Um, I, it, with the cloudiness and everything and all the uh, amount of fruit that was going to be in there, I thought it might be like a more of a medium body, but to me, I, I'm getting more of a thin a thin body on it. Well, like more like a water, water, you know, a seltzer. Good flavor. Good flavor. Um, So let's see. I'm getting the mango. I am getting um, I am getting that pineapple. It's kind of on the on the back end more. A light tangy lime. Um, I'm getting I'm getting a citrusness, so I guess I'm getting the citra. I'm not sure about the mosaic hops. I don't know what that tastes like, but in a mixed everything, I imagine it's, you know, 
it's what's making this taste really flavorful. The guava, I'm not totally sure about that either. There's just a bunch of flavors in here, so, which is making it a really good taste in uh, seltzer. Not getting the 6% alcohol, but it tastes like real fruit to me. Um, yeah, very, very flavorful. If someone poured this for me, I didn't know what they were giving me, and said, try this, I would probably think it was a a, uh, a thin-bodied IPA, but the... Yeah, it tastes good. Like I said, flavorful, fruity, citrusy. Um, nice carbonation. Um, this is a, a good quality hard seltzer. If they were more like this, I would, I would be more into probably seltzers. This is the kind of hard seltzer that that I I like. Um, so, excuse me. Very good. Okay. I'll pour some for Jeremy to try. We're gonna go about right here. And then if he likes it, I'll pour him a little bit more. Okay. Um, things, this thing's really good. Uh, I would like to try their, their other flavors that come out. Um, yeah, I, if you see this, on the market, if you see it, if you see it in stores or liquor stores, um, you like hard seltzers. I would say give this thing a try. Um, I don't know. I, I don't know if they're available yet. I think I think they're just sending an amount to some of the reviewers to to review to see what people think about it and see what the reviewers think about it. Maybe, um, but. Uh, So as for me, I like it. I don't know what the other guys are gonna say, but um, yeah, there's not a there's not a website on here. I don't know how new this company is. I've never heard of it before. Um, <clears throat> yeah, there's not a. But look them up. Go to go to their website, and I haven't been there yet. And check them out. Willie's. I know I'm missing it. Oh, here it is. Learn the story and join the. Okay, this is about cleaning up the, the beaches. Super beach cleanups. Learn the story and join the cleanups at superbrew.com. So you can go there and read about that, and maybe tell you other stuff. It's also gluten free and it says drink real. Okay, so there you go. I know it's a longer, it's a longer uh, review, I apologize. But uh, this is a new product and I wanted to, to give it the best attention that I could, give it the best review I could and tell you all, all about it and what I think of it and stuff. So, so there you go, okay. Well, thank you, Willie Superbrew uh, Company, for sending this to me. I appreciate it in this cool little glass. This is a really good hard seltzer. Yeah, very, very refreshing. Very enjoyable. Okay, thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. And we will see you all on the next one.